welcome back to Ladies First and another episode of Two Girls Women. Today we are at Robinson Road and we are at Slap Dance Studio to learn some pole dancing. So it's actually my first time pole dancing. How about you guys? First See? time. But yeah, I'm quite scared but pretty excited at the same time. I'm gonna die because I have no core strength. <laughs> So now we're gonna go talk to the instructors to find out more about what pole dancing is. Mm -hmm. Let's go. So today we are here with one of our instructors. She's Jasmine. Hello, everybody. And also the owner of Slap Dance Studios. Yes, yes. I run Slap Dance Studio with Naoko and Charlene. We've had studios now for four years. We've got 1,500 students in the CBD area alone, and we've got three floors in Robinson Road. So how long have you been doing pole for? I started in uh, end of 2012, but I had to take slightly more than a year off because I got pregnant. <laughs> had a baby, then I came back. It's incredible that you're still looking this way after having a baby. In the time that you've been doing pole since the start till now, how do you think like it has changed? I would say more matured ladies are coming in as well, um, more mummies coming in as well, and I also see more men. We're pretty open to all shapes, sizes, ages, all walks of life. We start out with anyone from any kind of background. If you have no dance background, no fitness background whatsoever, you can join our classes. We have different aspects of pole dancing in our studio. We have the very sexy and sensual. We also have the other side of pole where you can take it up a notch or all the way up to certain do so low. So it's all up to you on what you like will give you the variety. In terms of physicality, this is pretty difficult. No, I think it's pretty challenging, but difficult, no. I mean, if you have uh, some practice, you'll be fine. What do you think about the stigma of pole in Singapore? Because it typically is associated with something that is a bit more sexy, a bit more scandalous per se, but how do you think that has changed? To be honest, in Singapore, we are fairly okay. I wouldn't say like we are super conservative as well. And then generally when I tell my friends, or even like my friends' parents, they know that I come here for pole fitness class, they are pretty open about it. So in Singapore, it's okay, but in America and Europe, when I talk to acquaintances and friends, you can see their reaction that there's still a stigma there, there are more stripper clubs so they know it's more towards the erotic and they will have this perception but in Singapore I think generally it's been okay. Okay. Yeah. Do you think that we will be able to pull it off? Why not? Do you know you've got youth on your side so that's good. So now we are gonna go downstairs and we're gonna pick up Hakim who's our special guest for today and he has no idea what he's gonna do. He's super fit and all so mm -hmm. I think he's in for like a treat. Yeah he's known for <laughs> He's known for his strength and like all his jumping rope, but let's see if he can do the pole. Am I like dressed for the occasion? Okay la, raise it. <laughs> oh, so you're really boxing? <laughs> okay. You're careful, you're careful. Right hook, left hook. Punch, punch. It's gonna be fun, okay. Okay. Yeah, I'm very excited, but I'm nervous at the same time. Oh my god. Step into a healthier lifestyle. Okay, wow. and... Oh shit. Welcome! <laughs> I'm gonna go out. Welcome! Oh my god! Welcome! Oh, yeah, yeah. Hi! Oh my god! <laughs> no! Hi! Hi! Jasmine, nice to meet you! I'm Kim, nice to meet you! Kim, nice to meet you! So much you want me to go here! Yeah, Kim, nice to meet you! Nice to meet you! Alright, so you're all dressed, we're ready! What do you think? My mind isn't ready for this! I want 
you guys to do, and girls, you're gonna bring your right knee pit around the pole. One more time. You bring your right knee pit around the pole. Let your hands go. Give it a quick wiggle. Do you feel good? Bonk. Good. Right hand on, left hand down. Now we're just gonna spin one round. Push off of your left. Good. Bring your left down. Excellent. One round. Only one. Student at the back. Yes. Left hand over, push off. Bring your left over your right. Look at yourself in the mirror. I think I can do this pretty easily. So. Right, hold on. Seven, eight, right. And left. And right. And left. Right leg goes up. Right hand goes up. And we're going to do the game show for two rounds. Take it from the top, let's go. Right, and left, and right, and left. Flick it up, and over, and shake, and shake. Left down, right up, right hand up, two circles. Ready, and over, yes. Bring it down, and down, good, again. We have 
on to the end of the class. How do you guys feel about today? Tired. It was fun, but tiring. But fun. I didn't expect it to be like as difficult as it was because now my armpit hurts, my knee hurts, and everywhere hurts. <laughs> yes, that's true. The abrasion that you get is also like no joke. Really like to go out the pole. It's just entirely like skin friction. I think that's also why they they wear like crop tops and like hot shorts and everything to so have more grip. Yeah. I'm gonna buy a sports bra after this. I'm gonna buy a sports bra and then I'm, I'm gonna get like short shorts. Are you gonna get a pole in your house? You install one? Yeah, probably. You can practice at home. I'm so done. I didn't even have any strength like most of the time, and I like suffered a lot. I have a newfound respect for pole dance. Yeah. yeah, really. They make it look so easy, right? But oh my god, your strength is amazing. <laughs> like I was trying not to like quiver, but they do it with like so much like grace, grace and, and voice, voice. And right? <laughs> So as our Mr. Mr. Fitness verdict, is this harder or jump rope is harder? This is a lot harder than jump rope. I think I'm gonna stop jump roping and I'm gonna do pole dancing from now on. <laughs> My favorite part is the warm up. I still enjoy it. I'm gonna do it at home. <laughs> what the warm up? <laughs> yeah, the warm up. <laughs> My favorite part is the breaks in between. <laughs> But another thing about pole is that not, not only does it make you very fit, but it also like in a sense allows you to embrace your femininity and it allows you to remember that like hey I'm a woman and it's okay to be sexy sometimes, you know? Yeah. I'm a man. But it's okay to feel sexy. Yeah, too. but it's okay. Yes. Yeah, exactly. It's okay to have a feminine side. In femininity is strength. Yes. It's, yeah. Mind boggle. Thank you, Hakim, for joining Thank us you. today. Thank you guys for inviting me. Very brave me. soul. I had a lot of fun, I had a lot of fun. It's kind of fun. Very proud of you. Thanks, yeah. I think you I love are. you guys. Aww. I mean girls, sorry. So we've come to the end of today's episode. If you guys like it, do give it a like and make sure you guys subscribe and let us know what you want to see next in the comment section down below. And we'll see you next time.